First down and goal at the five. Fields rolls out. Throws it. Incomplete. Smith in Jigba, the intended receiver. In the class, a five-star player. You look as he's trying to get that well control. Uh oh, uh -oh. oh, he may have gotten that foot in. Goodness. That looks like a catch and a touchdown. They oh. ruled it incomplete, but that was clearly a touchdown. No doubt about it. No doubt about it. With the play action, pitch far side, and there's the catch made by Smith and Jacob, one of the talented true freshman receivers. I wouldn't want to upset Justin Fields, but second down at 11. And Fields able to complete it to Smith and Jigba. Bringing all three of those guys right up in the middle of Justin Fields' face. And Ohio State's having a hard time blocking. A loss of two. Fields off his back foot. He finds his receiver. This time it's in Jigba. Second down and eight. Play fake. Stroud drops it off in the flats. That's Jackson Smith in Jigba. Travion Henderson in the backfield. And they throw it underneath. Nice throw, nice catch. Smith and Jigba on the move. And Jackson Smith. Bucks need to get to the 34 for first down. Stroud guns it. And caught. That's a great throw. Smith and Jigba. Stroud. Underneath. Caught. Touchdown, Buckeyes. Jackson Smith and Jigba. The safety's way far over here. What that allows Stroud to do is just put his eyes on him ever so slightly right when he gets the ball, and he knows he's got a huge hole to work with for Jackson Smith. Stroud throwing on first down. Up. Jackson Smith and Jigba. What a catch in traffic. Ryan Williams in the backfield. Here's Stroud looking underneath. Pumps, delivers, and Smith and Jigba getting jiggy with it. So they need at least probably about 20, 25 yards before the last snap. First down from the 11. Stroud in trouble, delivers, and it's caught. Met his dad in the lobby of our hotel yesterday. Wonderful guy. Stroud on the run again. Brought in by Smith and Jigba. No touchdowns. Five wide. Plus an interception. Empty backfield. Nice. That is a nice slant by Smith and Jigba. Playing some really good football from Zips. And a Michigan State transfer, so a guy that's played Ohio State before. Here popping it in front to Jackson Smith and Jigba. And there's some solid yardage for Ohio State. What a talented combination they had there in Philly. Underneath this time it's Jackson Smith and Jigba for the 36 yard line. Wasn't able to start training camp on time. Missed, I believe, 10 days of practice. There's a throw complete. Touchdown. Jackson Smith and Jigba. Best pass of the night for Kyle McCord. Throw it downfield. A little slot go route on Jackson Smith and Jigba adjusting to the football. And it has to feel good for the true freshman. To connect on something deep downfield. Touchdown, Buckeyes. Two, three yards. It's not just a burst. It's a burst with some serious explosion. Yeah, he reminds me a lot of myself. That's caught <laughs> shut down. Inside the 15, another catch for Jackson Smith and Jigba. Alabama, Auburn, Pitt State, Oregon, out of high school. Jalen Kelly Powell, eight-yard loss, second and 18. Jackson Smith and Jigba gets a little bit of that back to set up third down. They fumbled, by the way, on their first possession into the end zone. It wasn't buzzed down, but I'm not. People don't <laughs> yeah. forget, Brandon. Yeah, right. Stroud between the hashes complete. Look out, Smith and Jigba. And Jackson Smith and Jigba finally swung around to the ground by Fadu Kasi. This three-headed monster in the wide receiver room at Ohio State. And Jackson Smith and Jigba is the third one. He operates in the slot, and you see the talent there. He was third in conference with seven. You go ahead and draw the charge on a fast break. <laughs> Alave with that last catch, by the way, went over 100 yards. And here it's Smith and Jigba as he's pushed out of bounds. Look at the touch here. 
knew exactly where he wanted to go. He's covered. He says, it doesn't matter. I'll put the football exactly where it needs to be. And Jackson Smith and Jigba working on Trey Avery that time. But the throw by Stroud. Now the empty out Master Teague. Stroud with plenty of time. He connects. He finds Jackson Smith and Jigba. And he's got enough for the first down. Right, you're going to have to earn your yards. This is a good little lesson the freshman's feeling here early on. Stroud swings. Jackson Smith and Jigba's got it for a first down. Stroud zips it down the middle, and he finds Smith and Jigba. Another big play strike from C.J. Stroud for 44 yards this time. Read by C.J. It is the point man in that bunch that versus cover two is going to run right by that linebacker. These linebackers have been victimized. That time, that's give them an opportunity. Now, Olave in particular, such a great deep ball catcher. Zip to the boundary. This time completing Smith and Jigba. Uh, gave a lot of praise to Brian Hartline, who was obviously a terrific player here. That was Smith he and was Jigba. Ter terrific player here for the Buckeyes and then in the NFL. Second down and four. And Stroud back to throw. Again, dumps it off. Smith and Jigma able to get to the edge. And then turns on the Jets to get the first down to the 11-yard line. The front runner right now for the Heisman, but C.J. Stroud making some noise. He's the Ohio State quarterback. He'll throw it here on first down, has all day, and a money throw inside the 45 to Smith and Jigba. What a toss. In front of the safety and perfectly placed to Jackson Smith and Jigba. Second down and seven for freshman quarterback C.J. Stroud. Moving out of the pocket, throwing on the run, and a catch made again. Smith and Jigba goes down to get it at the 39-yard line. And not in a rush here, plenty of time, minute 20 and counting. Stroud on second and four, another money pass as Smith and Jigma tried to go up in the air, and then, wow, he got smacked by Devon Matthews. Just pick a position, and they've right. recruited really well at it. Yeah, they really have, certainly have. Stroud on second down, and first down catch by Smith and Jigba. Justin Fields is a former Buckeye starting. It's the first time Brady's played against an Ohio State quarterback since he got in the NFL. Think about that for a second. Second and 11, Stroud downfield, caught by Smith and Jigba fighting, and down to about the three-yard line. And we're going to show the pocket again. You see twist game up front, picked up perfectly. Well-thrown football on a nice round. Empty backfield. Penn State doesn't get near C.J. He gets the ball out. Hard hit deliver after Smith and Jigba made the catch. From the Penn State defense. They're known for this. Buckeyes need nine on third down. Crossing route. Completion to Smith and Jigba. He's got a first down. Second and 11 after the penalty. Penn State brings pressure. It's picked up. And the throw again is low. Going down to get it is Smith and Jigba. Stroud's done that quite a lot so far. Three-man rush. Stroud should have plenty of time. Does he have someone to throw to? Late throws it low again, and that's Smith and Jigma going down. Stroud delivers short. And Smith and Jigma breaks free. Breaks the tackle. It's a foot race. And they finally run him down near the 15-yard line. Joey Porter saved the touchdown, but an electric play. But I want you to keep an eye on 16. Brown, Jair Brown has to make the tackle to catch, but a poor angle right there. Check down short, and Smith and Jigba wrestled down by Deshaun Hart or Daquan Hardy. Stroud to throw it on third and four off his back foot over the middle caught by Smith and Jigba and a first down. Stroud looking delivers and it's caught by Smith and Jigba. Play fake. Stroud steps up in the pocket throws. And caught by Smith and Jigba once again. This kid is really starting to find his rhythm. 
Smith and Jigba, the deep man. He'll backpedal. And catch it over his shoulder at the 20. Turns it up. Looking for a crease. And goes out of bounds at the 35. Stroud drops back. Sets. Delivers. Smith and Jigba. Nice hesitation move. And he'll get down the sideline. Middle of those runs, in the midst of those runs, this defense has got to maintain their proximity. C.J. Stroud to Smith and Jigba. Great move. Gets down the sideline. And a burst. Smith and Jigba. Touchdown, Buckeyes. Touchdown, Ohio State. Smith and Jigba, this is just an, an ordinary route. He's just going to run just inside. He gets the completion, but then it's turned the Jets on. And watch his partner down the edge. That's Chris Olave, the unselfish hustle, getting down the field and getting just enough of a block right there. Stroud off his back foot. Sideline caught Smith and Jigba out of bounds. Punting from inside his own 10. Smith and Jigba, the deep man for the Buckeyes. Good punt. Smith and Jigba to the sideline. And a solid return as he goes out of bounds, crossing the 45. First down and 10 of the 48. Henderson. No, over the middle they find Smith and Jigba. Five catches, 51 yards. First down and 10. Underneath. Smith and Jigba, first down. Second down and 15. Play fake. Stroud shuffling underneath. And caught. Well Stroud done. Smith and Jigba 11. again. Five, six minute mark in a two possession game. Stroud guns it to the sideline. And it's Smith and Jigba having a career day. Stroud is able to hit him for a first down. Olave, six catches, 57 yards. Underneath a wide open Smith and Jigba. And he'll get deep inside. Teagan now for Henderson. Stroud over the middle. And a catch by Smith and Jigba. With under two minutes to go, and you're throwing the ball. Why? I, I don't know. I did not understand it. They throw it again here. It is complete. He's trying desperately to get into field goal range. This guy's release is ridiculous, and yet the ball still jumps out of his hand. JSN coming around, and he finds space. Jackson Smith and Jigba. They're marking him out at the 21-yard line. On the end of the line of scrimmage, go out and secure. And look how long is to hold this block. I mean, forever. He does so beautifully against Jalen Graham to allow Jackson Smith and Jigba. And the hot streak continues for number 11 of the Buckeyes. Guys that have come before him that are so good. So he's been really impressed with the way he's handled himself here. And here he is on second and six connecting with Jackson Smith and Jigba. That's where he's at his best and certainly looks that way today. Off the timeout as JSN rotates back. Of the NFL's defensive style, they're using it there for Purdue as well. Stroud on second and five. Look at how wide open JSN is. You see the bunch up at the top. Number seven, Jamari Brown, pointing to Jackson Smith and Jigba, who's not there. There's the bubble to the outside to Jackson Smith and Jigba. He is wrestled down beyond the 30-yard line by Mackey. I mean, there have been so many opportunities where Buckeye made Boilermakers look silly for some of the moves in the open field. Here is Smith and Jigba. Oh, what a move inside the 20. He jumps back inside. Crowd looking left goes out there to JSN and he was wrapped up by Cam Allen immediately. Walk it back to a first and 20. Stroud in cut and Jackson Smith in Jigba. Third down and 11. Stroud shallow cross underneath as he goes to JSN who tried to reach out for that line to gain. A strength most of the year with the exception of the Penn State Nebraska game. Hot pass, Jackson Smith and Jigba, the blazing sophomore.
Very dangerous play for Ohio State all season long. Spartans do a pretty good job defensively. You're in the game, and in the blink of an eye like Purdue last week, it's 7-7, and it's 35-7. That's what Ohio State can do. Smith and Jigba. Quick game around the left side. And Ryan Day will continue to be. Michigan State has struggled all year defending the pass. It's been talked about by every analyst all week. Stroud on the run. Flips it short. Smith and Jigba. Reach back behind him, makes the catch. First down at midfield. Because of COVID restrictions. Smith and Jigba gets a couple blocks, makes a cut, and is knocked down at the 25. And the punt drives it nicely. Low kick into the wind. Fielded back there. And Smith and Jigba. Stroud, it's a wide open Smith and Jigma. Can't shake the tackle of Lowry, but another it's just chunk the, play. The spacing. They, they've just gone to another level with that, that receiver room. Stroud, Smith and Jigma. It, it starts with a quarterback. When you know that you've got a quarterback who's going to be around, who's going to throw you the ball. That holds Wake would have to win at Boston College next week to win the division. Buckeyes right back at it here. Smith and Jigba makes a cut and ducks down inside the 30. Good to see the big fella get his opportunity. You know, he has had some injuries. He's also seen a true freshman go right by him. Stroud rolling, stretches the play. Flips it back to the end zone. Jackson Smith in Jigba. Touchdown number six. So you have Gross right here. He's going to try to stay with Jackson Smith in Jigba. And, and for a while, he's in pretty good position. But watch both defenders right here. They end up jumping together, working together, and they end up colliding. And the whole time, I, I really thought you'd see Stroud give up on it and just kind of throw it away. But he sees this. All of a sudden, he said, wait, last time I looked at you, you were covered. And then a couple defenders collide, and it opens it up for an easy touchdown pass. Some of these other guys, they've had some injuries to the corner spot. They're just a, a, a team that I think is only going to get more and more talented. But they've had to make the most of what they have. Smith and Jigba in space. Scotty Hazelton, the defensive coordinator. One time on that catch by Olave. He kind of ducked down. And Henderson, on the other hand, they're, they're, they're taking, protecting him. Smith and Jigba, stiff arm. You know, they, they eased Travion Henderson into the season, saving him for the stretch run now with the score. Second and eight at the 24. Stroud with time and throws over the middle, and it's caught. Jackson Smith in Jigba, one from player. Stroud, sideline caught. Jackson Smith and Jigba makes a first man miss. And he'll get it to the 24, an eight yard gain. Smith and Jigba lines up in the slot. He's dangerous there. Stroud underneath. Smith and Jigba first down and more. As he goes down at the 25. Little mismatch here. Smith and Jigba against David Ajabo. That's a ball that he's going to get 100%. And Jigba is going to be at the bottom of your screen right there. Stroud. And he'll hit in Jigba for first down. First down at the 35. Stroud again to throw it. Looking with time over the middle. Caught. Jackson Smith and Jigba again finding a soft spot. Brad Hawkins with the stop. C.J. Stroud delivers. Stroud to Smith and Jigba. But once again, it's R.J. Moten. Second and ten. Stroud over the middle. And another completion. Or two or three in them. Here's Stroud looking and caught by Smith and Jigba. First down. And now you present yourself with an opportunity to get off the field. Third down and 19. Here they come. CJ Stroud bouncing around. Stroud delivers to the sideline and caught by Smith and Jigba. What a catch! Stroud keeps himself alive. Watch this. He's not even close to open. This is just absolute trouble. 
Travion Henderson in the backfield. Stroud over the middle. Smith and Jigba with the catch. And Smith and Jigba with the first down. Stroud over the middle. Caught in Jigba. And he's short of the first down. Check it down. Smith and Jigba, who's so effective at turning short passes into long gains, knocked out on the far side. He's listed at 5'8", 225. He looks thicker than that to me. First down throw. Smith and Jigba is open. And again, Stroud drops it in. Stiff arm all the way to the end zone. Touchdown, Jackson, Smith, and Jigba. Accuracy again to C.J. Stroud. Just in rhythm. Separation. Puts that ball on that sideline where Smith and Jigba can get to it, gets away from Bernard, and a blink of an eye, Ohio State down seven. Talk about the other two guys who are not here today, but Smith and Jigba had the third most receiving yards. Well, it's controversial when you see it like that. It didn't appear to be vicious, but he's done for the game. Stroud, touchdowns in his last two completions. Can he make it three in a row? Smith and Jigba, touchdown! And Ohio State answers instantly from 52 yards. High and too high. And watch what they end up going to here. They end up going with a too high safety look, which opens up a nice throwing lane behind those linebackers. And this is the dangerous part of Smith and Jigba. Six feet, about 200 pounds. Great block by Fleming is what he does. Play clock winding down. Stroud from the pocket. Crossing round. Catch made. Smith and Jigba. Stiff arm, and it's a first down. And you got no timeouts left. You need about 25 yards to get in the range that Ruggles was showing in the warm-up. Throw underneath. They'll move to six. It'll be now a brief fire. Stopping. He's going to fire this to kill the clock. The first down also, obviously. Smith and Jig was in the backfield to the right of Stroud. CJ fires across the middle. It's Smith and Jigba again. Weaving his way, they finally truck him at the 20 yard line. Makai Bernard saved the touchdown. That ball came around. And ends up getting behind Lloyd and in front of the safety. Look at Utah, they're expecting it. Problem is, you gotta try to get back, you gotta get depth. See if that ball comes out. Got Smith him that first down, Chris. Smith and Jigba circles back to get him the ball behind the line of scrimmage. And Smith and Jigba adding to his Rose Bowl record for receiving yards. Keyshawn Johnson talked about the game he had against Northwestern for USC. After the timeout, first down from midfield, Stroud on the move, flips it across, and Smith and Jigba answers and adds to a record setting day here. Fleming looks like he had his shoulder popped back in. Yeah, to be seen Fleming back. Team back made the catch and Stroud on second down. Here's a slam. Smith and Jigba still alive. Stiff arm and a record breaking afternoon gets even more impressive for number 11. Comes off from his left all the way back to his right. He got the quick slant. Again, the accuracy to Smith and Jigba gives him a chance to make the catch in traffic and then have a chance to do what he did, which is yards after the catch. To the far right of the formation. Looks like they're trying to create space over the middle. Four man rush. Stroud has time. Delivers. Smith and Jigba. Who else? First down at the 30. Master Teague, who doesn't have a carry yet tonight, is now the tailback. Stroud launching for the end zone. Jump ball. Touchdown, Smith and Jigba. Are you kidding me? Receiver, high school and college. You need to study this film, if you're, especially if you're a slot receiver. Slot fade, pretty good coverage, by the way. Mata Eli was not in bad position, grabs that left arm, but how about the throw by Stroud? I think they're concerned about that. They're more concerned about trying to score and work a little clock. Stroud, Smith and Jigba. Sidesteps a tackler, wrestled down at midfield as he adds to a monster game. Stroud has plenty of time. And fires. Smith and Jigba makes the catch. Knocked out at the 12, 36 seconds left. Set far behind his quarterback. A pistol look. And then nice. across the middle of his call. That's Smith and Jigba. <laughs> yep.
after an opening series. He's been in the locker room. We're working to find out uh, his status for the rest of the evening. That's Smith and Jigba on the receiving. Here's C.J. Stroud underneath route caught Jackson Smith and Jigba. And he coughed it up. Did he get it back? 